at 11, a second vaccine for COVID-19 could clear a big hurdle today. The latest on Moderna's case for emergency FDA authorization. Good morning. This is CBS DFW News at 11. I'm Karen Borda. For the first time since the COVID vaccine arrived in Texas, we're hearing from Governor Greg Abbott. Nicole Jacobs has more. For starters, Governor Abbott praised the healthcare heroes, the UPS drivers, and the Trump administration's Operation Warp Speed for the successful delivery of the Pfizer vaccine. As of 9 a.m. this morning, the governor says 95,000 doses of the vaccine have already arrived in Texas and have been delivered to their designated health care facilities. The state is looking to continue those drop offs to hospitals, health care centers, clinics, pharmacies, freestanding emergency rooms, urgent care centers, and of course, long term health care facilities. 7,000 providers, we're told, are already lined up to receive this potentially life saving drug. The governor is banking on the Moderna vaccine getting the emergency authorization approval and adding to the doses the state will receive. With that, he says more than 1 million people will be vaccinated in the state of Texas in just one month. Texas has been a national leader in being able to structure a system to achieve this fast, effective, swift distribution of the COVID-19 vaccine. The state and the governor are already looking ahead to there being more vaccine options available to the general public as we head into the spring months. In Dallas, Nicole Jacobs, CBSN DFW.